Ice again, a double and a homer, each with two strikes. Just how locked in were you feeling? Just how much do you think? I know it's just one game, but how much can that carry you throughout a whole season? Yeah, absolutely. It's it's extremely important to get off to a good uh, good first start, and you know I think I had a little luck there too, <laughs> a couple of wind dated hits. But you know if you don't prepare well, then then you might not end up being lucky like that. So uh, I'm feeling good about it. Man, I think that was your first career start in three years in college. Just how good did it feel to go out there, get the start, and perform the way you did? Oh, that was awesome. That was, uh, I mean, that's one of the best moments of my life right there, uh, by far. Um, I was just so excited to be able to come to the field and just, you know, play and do what I love with guys that are around me that I just love so much. So I was just, I was just overjoyed. It was just overcome with emotions the entire day. Yeah, Matt, there was some, there's some talk about playing, platooning some guys in, in center field a little bit, and a couple of freshmen were pushing you some. You didn't get to play much in the fall. Um, what did that? What does that do? What did that do for you coming in, and in terms of motivation or mindset? How, how do you approach that, knowing you get the first start, but there's talk of playing some other guys? I just focus on what I can control. I mean, uh, you know, that's something that's out of my hands. I w- wish I could say I'm playing every day, but um, whenever I go in, I just give my best effort, and uh, whenever they put me in, that's all I do. So. Um, and you know we got we we're deep. We got a bunch of guys that can play. So uh, you know I, I got to give it my best effort whenever I'm out there. But we got a bunch of guys younger that are just really really good, really really good. Andrew, I know you're talking uh, before the season just how this offense might play a little faster, play a little bit differently. Just how did it feel to you out there today? It, you know, it seemed like you guys just scored and uh, attacked in a lot of different ways. Yeah, I mean it was a lot of uh, a lot of moving guys over, a lot of situational. Baseball, you know, I know uh, Bell had a sack fly, and and there's a couple times, you know, Wimmer had that RBI ground out right to the first base, and it's it's not sexy stuff, but it's it's what you got to do to win ball games, and um, you know, I think it's something you're gonna see a lot from us. It's just <laughs> situational baseball, situational hitting, and just getting the job getting the job done. Yeah. Hey Andrew, how's it going? Um, Good, how what you? were the emotions like for you heading into your final opening day with the team? Yeah, I mean, it's it's a lot of excited nerves like it is every year um but it, it is a little bittersweet you know um i think the last couple of years i thought that i was that was gonna be my last year and you know it didn't work out that way but now knowing that it is absolutely the last time uh you know i'll go out there for opening day it's it's bittersweet and and uh but you know today was a great day and and i really enjoyed it and then matt what's it like for you to play with someone in the outfield like eister i mean are you kidding me this guy's awesome i mean I, <laughs> he's the man I mean, I've learned so much just, just watching him play, watching him hit. I mean, not to mention he's probably one of the best guys you'll ever meet in your life. And he, he's going to laugh at me as I say that right now. But, I mean, he, he's got your back in every way, every way, shape, and form. And I, I'm blessed to be able to share the outfield with him. Andrew, you've been around a lot of freshmen. Braswell obviously had a pretty good day today, just seemed to bring some energy. Just what's different about him? What sets him apart from some maybe other freshmen? Yeah, I mean, he's just – He's just not scared, you know. He's got a swagger about him, and and you know he acts like he's got gone out here and done this a million times, and and uh, you know there's there's just no fear. Um, you know he had, you'd see from a few plays he had at shortstop, you know there's no there's no worry. Um, you can, there's no thoughts in his head running though, like oh I might I might screw this up. Uh, you know he's confident that he's going to make every play and and give us a good at bat, and you know we're confident in him to do that as well. Matt, how big of a role do you think you can play in this everyday lineup? Um, I mean, that's not up to me. Uh, I'd like to say I can contribute a lot, um, but that's just not in my control. I mean, if, if they put me in the lineup, I'm going to give it everything I got, like I said before. But, um, you know, I, I'm just excited to play every day. That's pretty much where my head's at. Um, and I take it day by day, too. I, I try not to think too far ahead. Um, I operate on, like, a 24-hour clock, so it's like – I'm only thinking of, so right now my head's on tomorrow. I'm not really thinking about what just happened. That's behind me. It's done with. We're moving on to the next game because uh, we want to we wanna make it deep this year. I, I, I really want to go to Omaha. I want to win this national championship. And um, But the focus has to be every single day on each individual game, every single pitch, uh, because you got to win the small things before you can win the big things. I'll answer that. He'll contribute a lot. He'll contribute a lot. <laughs> And Matt wanted to get your thoughts also on on Braswell, the just kind of the confidence he he brings. It seems like he's got a, a lot of energy. Does have you been around freshmen like that before? And you know what what do you think a little bow and arrow stuff that he? <laughs> <laughs> Absolutely. I mean, he's dynamic. 
I mean, he's, he's a kid. He's got fire. I mean, you know, every once in a while you got to pull him back a little bit. But, you know, that's – you got at the same time, you got to let him run with that because that's confidence. That's his fire. That's the way he plays. And he, he fires up the crowd. I mean, and he at the same time fires us up, you know. So it's like that's one of the guys that you root for and, and you want to play well. Thank you guys very much. Thank you guys. Appreciate it.